You already know what it is. It's your boy Lay back with another reaction, another review, another episode. Hey, Nukes Top 5. You up the bat. Bop. Bitch, I'm driving a Bennett. Most of you niggas is lazy. Happy you niggas for gazing. Yeah, I be spitting that crack shit. Cause I was born in the A. It's your boy Lay back. Welcome back to my channel. Hey, two things we gotta do. You gotta hit that subscribe button. I'm drinking this water. You already know what it is, man. Appreciate time, appreciate life in 2021. Make sure you hit the like button. Make sure you hit the notification bell. Stay up to date with all the videos, man. All right, we back with another reaction, man. We back with another Nukes Top 5. You already know what I need from you. I need you to drop with you in the chat, man. Let me know that you're with me. You know what I'm saying? All the way to the end, you feel me? But yeah, we got um, Top 5 Scary Ghost videos that'll make you cry for your mama, yo. If, I, if I'm in here crying in this video, I'm gonna cut it off. If it's gonna make me cry, I'm just gonna say that. But anyway, uh, let's go ahead and get into it. Fire Squad, what's poppin'? Let's get it. Top five ghosts call on camera. Don't wake the baby. Italian YouTubers Paolo, Debbie, and Simona from the YouTube channel PIT, Paranormal Investigation Team, were contacted by one of their viewers about a spooky local legend in a dark forest. Mm. The legend says that there's a certain tree in the woods and underneath it sits an old abandoned stroller. Then above the stroller, there's a bell attached to one of the tree's branches. Locals believe that in the stroller rests the spirit of a baby who tragically passed away under mysterious circumstances many years ago. Furthermore, it's believed that if anyone nearby makes too much noise, the spirit of the baby wakes up and the bell in the tree starts to ring. But even more ominous, it is said that when the bell rings, an evil entity comes to protect the spirit of the infant. And this entity will attack whoever disturbed the child. What? The PIT Paranormal Investigation Team travel to the mysterious forest and wait until nightfall. They search through the woods and eventually find the tree and the stroller. Hell no. They put an EMF detector inside and just wait. No me neanche a me con zero. Dai, ci Mamma mia. Raga, brilla. Raga, sta brillando. Sta brillando. Sta brillando. Sta brillando. Sta brillando. Oh, la campana, la campana. Ma non si sta muovendo più di tanto, eh. Io ero lì, eh. Io ero lì. Io ero lì, quindi adesso? Non si sta muovendo. Eh, ma poco. Ma il rumore l'ha fatto, eh. Prego, dimmi che sta torvendo. Dimmi. Non lo, so. non lo so, non lo so, non lo so. Ha suonato, ha suonato, ha suonato. Ha suonato. Ha suonato dopo, dopo che ha brillato l'M1. Quindi adesso? E quindi che ne so adesso? Paolo. Non mi piace. No. Quindi adesso in teoria, se è giusta la leggenda, sta arrivando qualcosa. Sì. Esatto. The bell rings, which according to the legend means that the baby has been disturbed and that the evil entity is coming for them. Both Debbie and Simone are more than a little freaked out right. and already feel surrounded by something that is lurking in the woods. Ooh. But Paolo wants to see more. He grabs the stroller and starts to threaten the entity, yelling aloud that he will take the baby away. What, what happens next? is downright chilling. Yo, he's tripping. Camera inside the crib. Poi non so se suggestione, raga. Io mi sento tirare la carrozzina. Che senso ti senti tirare la carrozzina? Come se dall'altra parte ci fosse qualcun altro che la sta me la come se me la stesse togliendo dalle mani. Me la sta spingendo. Mollala. Io dalla, dalla, dalla termica non vedo assolutamente niente, per dirtelo. Mollala. Io dalla termica non vedo niente di strano, guarda. Oh, oh mio guarda! Dio, mio Dio, si, muove, si muove, si muove, si muove! Paolo, Paolo, te l'ho detto, te l'ho detto. Aspetta, aspetta, aspetta. Paolo, Paolo. 
Paolo, Paolo, l'hai provocata. L'ho filmata. Ha funzionato. Ok, è qua. È qua, è qua, è qua, è qua, è qua. È qua, è qua, è qua. È qua, ok, ok. Paolo explains that he feels like someone is trying to push the stroller away from him. When he lets go, the stroller eerily just moves on its own. The team no longer believes that they're alone in the woods and they hear the unexplained sound of running footsteps What? all around them. Cos'è laggiù? Raga! 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 Cosa? Vi giuro l'ho vista passare. Ho visto passare qualcosa. Raga, l'ho filmato, sono quasi sicuro. Ho stretto la torcia. Raga, è passata una persona laggiù. È passato qualcosa laggiù, non un animale. The creepy figure of what appears to be a woman can be seen quickly what? running through the dark woods. Could this be the evil entity that is said to come what? when the bell rings? What? Is it possible that this female spirit could be protecting the long abandoned spirit What? of the child in the stroller? They wild Let me know wild your thoughts down in the comments. They wild The IT paranormal investigation team is now releasing their investigations in both English and Italian. I don't know if this is real, but if you're loud, the baby's gonna wake up. So you can watch this full three part series in English or Italian over on their YouTube channel. What? The Nightly Visitor. Chris Coltman from the Netherlands recently reached out to me through email, explaining that his family has been experiencing some very strange activity in their house. Chris says that his five-year-old son has been having terrible trouble falling asleep ever since the little boy's grandmother passed away. Mm. The five-year-old would wake up in the middle of the night, making the typical claim of any frightened child that there was, quote, something scary in his room. The boy repeated this multiple nights until finally Chris decided to buy a motion detection camera to prove to the child once and for all that there was simply nothing there. But instead, the camera captures something downright creepy. Now obviously because of the potato quality of the camera, it's hard to tell exactly what is going on here. All that we can make out is a strange dark shape that seems to move and disappear along the side of the boy's bed. Now, after reviewing the footage and seeing this bizarre incident, Chris decides to buy a new, higher quality camera. And sure enough, the camera captures something. What? Another unexplained dark shape seems to move right next to the boy What? as he sleeps. It almost looks like the translucent shape touches the boy's hand. And the child even seems to react to the touch in his sleep. Another night, and Chris is laying in bed with his son to comfort him, waiting until the boy falls asleep so that he can sneak out of the room. But then, this happens. Hell nah. <laughs> exactly. Books sitting on top of a shelf suddenly get tipped over and fall hard onto the floor. Chris and his son wake up and the boy's mother quickly hurries into the room to see if the two are okay. Both Chris and his wife have no idea what just happened. So are Chris and his family haunted by an invisible entity that only his son can see? Fuck. And if not, then just what is this? Let me know what you think. If you see a video that you think would be perfect for the top five, or if you have a ghost hunting channel and you caught Whoa. something great, contact me at nukestop5 at gmail.com. Aldo sees something.
Indian YouTuber Robbie from the YouTube channel Biryani Man and his friends set out to explore an abandoned house in Madras, India. The four friends don't know much about the house other than that the building was abandoned because the property is said to be extremely haunted. Once inside, they find something very disturbing. <laughs> Team member Vicky is a bit upset by an old rope hanging from the ceiling inside one of the rooms. But the other guys don't really seem to think much of it. But then, YouTuber Robbie sees something shocking right behind him. Hello, open this door. In, in door, door the door, in the door open mana parom. Hello, I'll see that. Mm. Open out that. Hello, mm. hello, hello. So I'm open it. Get time. Let number Vicky get it. Come Vicky, Vicky. Sorry. Come here. Hey, nice. Hey, 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 Someone or something seems to walk from left to right, right behind the unsuspecting group. When they check out the area, oh. there's just no one there. The four friends decide to take a quick break outside the house to gather their thoughts. And that's when things get truly bizarre. <laughs> Again, a dark figure can be seen, this time from one of the upstairs windows. The guys go back inside to check it out. What? And it did not go well. Why did they go well? <laughs> He's crying for real. Now to be clear, I am in no way saying that what the guys have captured is anything paranormal. It could simply be a squatter or a homeless person in the building. I just don't know. But what I do know is that team member Aldo seems genuinely terrified of what he's seen. Inside the building, he claims he saw a horrifying figure. And he even starts to cry out of fright. Just as Aldo is explaining what he's witnessed, the team is shaken up by a loud bang. And they all run to their scooters and just get out of there. Shortly after, they stop to check on Aldo. Poor Aldo is still in tears, and they decide to just end the video and go home. Fuck. So what do you think Aldo saw that terrified him this much? Is it all real? Is it all just a hoax? But if it is a hoax, Aldo either wasn't in on it, or he's one of the best actors ever. Right. Because those are real tears. Anyway, as always, you decide. The curse. From the time it was built in the 1960s, Ooh. the Okako Onsen Inn in Tajimi City, Japan was met with terrible misfortune. Some believe that the land the inn was built on was cursed from the beginning by a dark spirit. 
Local legend claims that a woman passed away under horrible circumstances on the property in the mid-1600s, and that she still haunts the property grounds. So cut to the 1970s, and there is a severe food poisoning incident at the Okago Onsen Inn that absolutely ruins the reputation of the popular hotel. Even worse, soon after this, not one but two fires destroy large parts of the building and end several lives. Damn. The Okago Onsen Inn was closed down for good. Locals say that the devastating events left the inn's owner in complete financial ruin. In hopelessness and despair, he ended his own life by jumping from the inn's roof. What? Today, the inn has been abandoned for 40 years and the building is buried in overgrown weeds and vegetation. Rumors spread that the location is cursed and that anyone who enters the inn will suffer a horrible fate. Those few who have dared to enter the inn claim that they have seen and heard the spirit of the woman who curses the hotel. They also say that they have seen the apparition of what is believed to be the inn's former owner who jumped from the roof. Damn. So Japanese paranormal investigators Tomo and Hiro from the YouTube channel Omagatoki Film have heard the terrifying ghost stories and are ready to investigate the allegedly haunted inn. Together with their anonymous cameraman who goes by the name T, they start their investigation of the creepy building. Tomo and Hiro decide to take photos of each other inside the second floor's restroom, which is said to be one of the most active paranormal spots in the entire building. Things quickly take a very eerie turn. Nothing out of the ordinary can be seen in Tomo's pictures. But when it's Hiro's turn, they discover that in one of the photos, the reflection of his face seems to be staring straight at the camera. The team is a little freaked out, but they shrug it off and decide to head up to the rooftop of the abandoned inn. The rooftop is barely recognizable as it's completely covered in dirt and weeds after being abandoned for 40 years. It is said that the owner of the inn jumped from this rooftop, taking his own life. While exploring, cameraman T gets spooked by something. <laughs> Cameraman T is frightened as he claims he heard the voice of a strange woman whispering in his ear and dropped his camera in fear. Later, the three team members watch the footage back that he recorded. They are shocked by what they find. <laughs> I'm 
もらってもらえるよマジでえっ、ー、何Did you see it? Right after the camera falls, an upside down face can be seen staring right back at the camera. Could it be that this is the face of the owner who took his own life on that very same rooftop? Or is it the woman's voice who cameraman T heard right before he dropped his camera?、What? Let me know your thoughts、What? down in the comments. You can watch this full terrifying investigation over on the YouTube channel Omega Toki Film. Meanwhile,、What? on TikTok, TikTok user Nina Enton shared a creepy video of her nephew, Emmy, on her TikTok page. In the video, the boy discovers the hidden nanny cam that's carefully placed in his bedroom to keep a safe eye on him. But what happens next is downright chilling. The terrifying face of what appears to be an elderly woman can be seen staring at the camera. Nina claims her nephew was alone in his room at the time of this recording. Now, fake or not, when I first saw this video, it freaked me out. So, either way, the video is definitely very creepy. But as for whether it's real or fake, as always, you decide. In another video, TikTok user 172.75c claims that he、What? bought a haunted ring and that ever since he brought it home,、Why? strange things have started happening、Why? around his house. Why would you buy that? I heard some noise down here, not the washing machine, but some like weird f***ing thumping, and this f***ing thing was rocking back and forth when I came down here. Doors started shaking. Unexplained voices can be heard at night.、Peace. And a rocking chair suddenly started rocking back and forth all on its own. TikTok user 172.75c shares his experiences on a regular basis on his TikTok page. One night, he films as he starts to feel sick from the paranormal activity around his house. He's scared. Later, TikTok viewers are shocked when they see something in the video that he did not see. Something truly bizarre. Going to go in、uh, my car for tonight. I'm not feeling good. I'm actually starting to get ill. Did you see it? TikTok user 172.75c is completely unaware that the dark silhouette of someone or something. Can be seen standing right behind him in a room.、What、he explains in another video that he had no idea what was with him in his house, and that since this incident, he has been staying with a friend, too scared to return to his home. So, is it real, or is it all just an elaborate TikTok hoax? You decide. All right, that was top five scary ghost videos that'll make you cry for your mama, bro. That shit was scary. I ain't even gonna cap. That was one of the scariest ones so far, man. What? Why would you buy a haunted ring? Why would you even do that? Oh my God, bro. If you made it to the end, man, I need you to drop real one. What the? F that one was creepy. That one was creepy, man. But you already know, man. Self love and positivity. Till next time, Fire Squad. I got you and you know it. Hey.